what up guys this is us excuse me what am i saying this is us why us this is me b headman or ak black headman today i'm making with another android studio tutorial for you and uh, what i decided to teach you today um is called menu um but it's actually kind of like kind of like options on three dots here that appear on your action bar by the way this uh test pro this uh, the bar that i'm uh selecting now is called action bar and uh, what i'm gonna teach you today is that uh, if you have seen those three dots that appear on top of each other uh, they are called uh, menu or uh, some people uh, call it um, options so for having that um, come to your risk or uh, resources uh, folder or directory and right click on that and um, click on new and directory once you've done that um, give it a name it must be menu um, lowercase it should be menu and uh, you shouldn't change that, that and right click on that again and new menu resource file and once you've done that once you've done that give it a name and click on OK and you're good to go but after that opened up and as you can see that was the three dots this is what I was saying three dots and come to your menu file and open a tag and we have item click on that enter and close that and like all those other things um, in Android we have ID for this one so we simply write Android ID as you can see here Android ID because we need to give it an ID and um, let me just take that out ID and um, it should be kind of like mm, what let's say for example picture that's just an example and um, the other thing we need to give that is that Android title and the title you said here um, is that actually when you click on that uh, uh, on those three dots um, a menu will pop up and it has some uh, names or other things or icons this title is that actually um, that name that you see there so just give it a name and uh, what should we call it picture pic or pics and let's give it another item uh, actually we need another item and what we, what should we call this one um, android id and id for example this one music and the other thing android tile and by the way you have um, lots of options here that you can do and set for your um, menu and for example i click order in category and show us action title uh, condensed visible or app ns or this is other things uh, these are the things that I will explain later on and um, as I told you here it says Android icon you can set an icon for that as well so when an Android title uh, what should we need what should we uh, call it music why not what does it say hard coded string should use at time doesn't matter we don't need that and close out of that and come to uh, main activity and for having that three dot there um, here in action bar um, by default your uh, activity or your uh, main activity or whatever activity you are in is by default on activity I mean you don't have this part it's just activity okay 
but for having that three dot I mean uh, for supporting your uh, XML um, to have that uh, three dots or menu you have to come here and change it to app compact activity because app compact activity um, is a support class for activity and it will show that as well so we have to override something and um, what should we override here if I could see here I don't know what it was alt space no nope. control space and no come on override nope uh, let me just give you an example oh yes that was a control and insert if I can bring I don't know why it does not bring it for me there's insert thank you and that was alt insert yeah that was it sorry I was testing out I had not used it uh, for a long time and I was made in making mistakes so for uh, bringing the override or uh, generate methods menu you have to um, turn off your num lock number lock and your zero number uh, under that says the INS which stands for insert and you just have to um, hold alt plus insert and a generate menu will pop up for you and you just need override methods which has a control plus O shortcut and we need here on create and what we need after that on create menu where are you on create options menu and let me see if another thing is existing I'm sorry that was that um the one that says um let me just show you real quickly create options why am I typing on create um on create come on on create options menu if I see that actually that's not in the um overriding methods because I have overrided that and just search for uncreate options menu and it entered to override that and by default it says something like this return super dot uncreate options menu just delete this and write true return true that means um return yes we have used this one okay this true means a return something true that we have used it if that was false means uh, we have not used this options menu so put it on return menu and uh, we have to write some codes which are menu what am I typing menu inflator inflator if I'm wrong or correct equals get menu inflator and that's for this line come on but my system is so slow and the other thing and we go ahead and write inflator dot inflate and what should we inflate alt number one um we should inflate r dot menu come on dot pop up minus pop up menu and why is it giving me an error and yes that was because I didn't um, add menu and this menu to the end of the ordered menu that pop up menu 
so that was it and um, the other thing that we need we have to override another thing that um, let me just make it bigger and another thing that we need is that we have to override something else and what should it be on options item selected as you can see it's uh, yellow now and if I return it and just delete this one no actually it's too soon for you let me just um, keep this one and show you this way uh, we have to um, write something here that operates whenever uh, the user clicks on those um, items or whatever it is so we simply write if item dot get item ID as you can see it's here get item ID equals r dot ID dot the first one was picture if that was uh, the ID you got or the ID the user that clicked on that item was equal r dot ID dot picture which was uh, which is the um, first item first item um, just make it to make toast toast that make text come on make text get application context and the next one is the message um, picks clicked oh let me just uh, first bring up my motion emulator Come on. And Android Lollipop start. And that's it. Um the other thing that we need um toast that length for example long and at the end of that that show and that is it for this one and um, the other thing that we need is that we have to say exactly the same copy and paste if the item you got was exactly the same as music I think it was yep music um, give us another toast and say muse clicked and this one let it be on length line and nothing else so that return let it be on return and uh, let me just see if and Jenny motion has come up as you can see now guys uh, my emulator is running and uh, my three dots are here as you can see if I click on them a menu or another menu will pop up that says picks music and uh, these are the things that we declared for that and uh, to show up if I click on one of these it says picks clicked and music muse clicked and so on and so forth so um that was it for today um i hope you guys enjoyed this video and if you did please do me a favor hit that subscribe button down below i think it's here and um also check out my tutorials like ubuntu series they should appear here now um and java tutorial if you don't uh, if you're not familiar with android studio and um that was it for today don't forget to do me a favor hit that subscribe button and catch you the next